thing. You have a weak one IPBL match versus Ice and Isolate and the uh, the Great Lake Greninjas. So pretty excited for this match. You should definitely check out the team prep if you already haven't to see why I'm bringing what I'm bringing. Uh, we're gonna load up the team here. I'm gonna tell them good luck and have fun in a second. So I'm gonna yeah, we're gonna go into this. I'm gonna open up Notepad because I keep forgetting to do that. Ugh. All right, I'm excited. I hope we can pull out a win. Let's see what the team you brought. Okay, not bad. So I do immediately like leading out with Rosbaton. Er, let's see. No, not Rosbaton. I'm gonna lead out with uh, Escalators. I feel like that's a good idea and get a nice slow U-turn off. Because uh, everything on his team, except maybe the Golark, should outspeed me. So I, li I like that. I like that. We're gonna go with Escalators. Alrighty, here we go. So let's see what he's gonna end up leading out with. I'm not too threatened by Golurk, in all actuality. Like, I can't Volt Switch off it, but I'm not threatened by it. I do have Hidden Power Ice, which should do decently. Knockoff should also be very nice. So he's gonna lead out with Odysseus, which is indeed Golurk, because I, I bet he expected me to lead out with Escalators. Alright. So now this thing can't hit me with a ground type move. Um, I feel like going for a knockoff is a very good way to start this match off. Because I don't have any reason to swap out. He's in a mold breaker. And I can get a nice knockoff off on something. I believe Manaphy is one of his Z users. I don't remember the rest of them. Or the other one. It's probably Dragonite in all actuality. I could be wrong, but let's uh, let's check here. Yeah, Dragonite Manaphy. So he's gonna swap. He's gonna go into Amber, which is Ninetales. Indeed. Okay, so he did still bring Snow Warning. Interesting. There's nothing to take advantage of that. So, let's see. Is it gonna be... What are we gonna get rid of? Lefties. Okay. So you're probably a bulkier set. Alright. Well, let's go for a nice Volt Switch here. Um, I want to see what this thing is going to do. I do have the Assault Vest. He may predict the Volt Switch and go back into Golurk, which would, wouldn't be a big deal at all. Because still, the Golurk cannot touch Escalators. Uh, and Hidden Power Ice will do very decently against it. He's going to Nasty Ply. Okay. So that's a little bit unnerving, but I was gonna change the Shuckaberry on Princess because I didn't end up needing Shuckaberry. I guess maybe for that Golurk. Um, let's see, what do I want to do here? Because this Ninetales is super scary. I brought Leonardo specifically built to handle this thing. I do wish it was a normal turtle, but hey, what can you do? Alright, so um, I'm max special defense. Moonblast is going to not do a terrible amount. It's going to do a lot, but it's not going to do a terrible amount. Um, let's see. So I didn't have much special attack investment. Or did I? I had like 192. I think this thing is specially defensive. Um, I want to go for Roar rather than going for Scald. He's going to go for Freeze Dry. Alright, good. Freeze dry can freeze? Fuck! Not much I can do about that. If only I'd gone for Skull. I didn't expect it. I didn't expect Freeze dry to freeze. I didn't even expect Freeze dry. I expected Moonblast. So, anyways, there goes Leonardo. So that's dandy. Okay, well, I go into Escalators here, and I go for Thunderbolt. Because Thunderbolt will kill. Volt Switch did a lot. So Thunderbolt will kill. And I do have the Assault Vest, so I should live any hit. Sweet. Sweet. 
All right, good. All right. So I'm gonna go for. Do I want to go for Hidden Power Ice or Knock Off? I think I want to go Knock Off. Because I'd rather get rid of his item than hit him with a Hidden Power Ice. Because I'd rather just send in uh, Electivire or whatever else is Ice Beam. Because if he's banded, I definitely want to get rid of the band. Or of anything of the sort, like maybe a Lumberry. It could be Lumberry Outrage. He's gonna D dance. Break your multi scale and get rid of a Z move. Okay, so what I might try to do here is Tobin is my best bet to go in here. Now, what I want to see is if I... Because I can, I can go in here. I... <sighs> Shit. I want to actually look this up. I want to make sure that I can live... Because I'm pretty positive that I can live one attack. At the very least, like one Dragon Dance because of this thing's insane defense stat. Okay, I should be able to live any hit. So Tobin should be able to handle this. Tobin should outspeed. This thing is built to outspeed. So with... Uh, yeah, I mean... In all honesty, it's still better to go with Tobin here. Because I know there's literally no way I built this thing specifically to outspeed Dragonite. Never mind. I just remember he's got a D-Dance up, so he should outspeed. So. Waterium Z. I probably lost. <laughs> he could he could possibly think I'm scarfed here. Because I sent this thing thing in so quickly. Well if it was scarfed, I would have sent it in before I wouldn't have sacked off my Alright, hang in there, please Atlas, it's not stab. God fucking damn it. Funny. Doesn't matter, I can't kill it with Hidden Bower Ice, so. Great. 